Hi there, here we have the 2007 Jaguar XKR. This is the 4.2 supercharged. I'll do a video walking around the car, showing you the condition of the bodywork. I'll also be showing you the, um, the interior and all the controls as well once we go inside the car. So starting off with the front, it does have the Xenon headlights. Front bumper, a few age related marks. Obviously, it is a 2007, so it has age related marks. As you can see, a few chips just there, a few very, very minor marks on the, um, on the front bumper. Obviously, from a distance, these are not visible, however, it is nice to point them out just so you know exactly what's, um, what's on the car. Bonnet, very, very minor chips as well, once again. So, as you can see, one just there, another one just here. As I say, from a distance, not visible. However, it is nice to point these out. As you can see, the air vents are obviously supercharged, they're written on them. Alloys all around the car are nice and clean. So these are the 20 inch alloys. I will be pointing them out once we go around. Just to point out, windscreen does have a few chips as well, as you can see. Alloy is once again nice and clean. It does have full service history. Rashmore's have been looking after the car and maintaining this car since 2012. So all these services and anything it needed mechanically, we've, we've been doing it since 2012. Moving at the back of the car now, it does have the rear parking sensors. Nice R badge at the back. Very, very nice view from the back as you can see. Rushmore's have done a full mechanical check on the car, a full service, and a new 12 months MOT will also be done at point of sale. It does also come with um, AA warranty as well as the 12 months breakdown cover. So that all comes in with the price of the car. You do also have the option to extend your warranty up to 36 months. So this is something we highly recommend at Rushmore's. Obviously more as peace of mind than anything when buying a car like this. So chrome, it's a very, very nice color combination. You've seen the exterior, let's jump inside the car, show you the interior as well. So starting off with the front passenger door, nice and clean. It does have the memory electric seats, as you can see just there. Upgraded sound system as well. So it does give it a nice sound system inside the vehicle. Dash is all nice and clean. It does have the full leather heated seats. As you can see just there on the headrest, it does also have the R badge once again. It does also have the two seats at the back. We've also Isofix on them. Right, let's have a look at the uh, boot space as well. So it does have a very decent boot space, as you can see. It does also have the, um, it's like a parcel shelf, let's call it. Um, so it does give you that privacy so no one can see, can see inside your um, inside your boot. Right, before we go over to the driver's side, um, as I will see you through all the controls, let's have a look at the door once again. So driver's side door, once again, nice and clean does have the front electric windows. You also have your electric door mirrors. So you can adjust your door mirrors just there. Once again, the um, electric memory seats. It does also have the lumbar support, as you can see just there. So another, another nice thing to have, obviously, so you um, have the comfort. Upgraded sound system, as I mentioned. And let's have a look at the back seats once again. So obviously, I'm not sure. Well, it depends whoever's, whoever's obviously um, at the back but it does have the two seats as well in case someone does need to go at the back right so it does have the leather multifunctional steering wheel we obviously the pedal shift it's also got your cruise control on this side you also have your um your buttons for your um for your radio as well very nice r badge just there once again it does have the auto wipers 
and auto lights, which is obviously ideal to have. Down here we have the fog lights. We also have the um, fuel release and also the um, the rear tailgate as well. It is keyless go this one, so the key is currently in my pocket. If I press the start button, the ignition does go on. Let's just turn the volume down. There is the warning light, obviously, so it says press brake when um, when starting the car. Ignition is on, so that's your warning light, so don't worry about that. It does also have the engine management light on, that's because the ignition is currently on. So once again, do not worry. It is um, nothing on the car. We've done a full mechanical check on it. What I'll do is let me actually get inside the car and start the car up. Okay, right. So at the moment we are on the screen. So as you can see, it does have the climate. And then if we go onto the climate, heated seats. You also have obviously your um, your front demister, um, also the back as well. So that's all on there with your temperature. It's very, very nice and easy to use. If you want to go back, you go onto the home page just there. Let's go onto the navigation. Oh, I think I went, yep, there we go. Thought I pressed the um, phone there, but I didn't. That's great. I've pressed, I've pressed onto the um, sat nav. So it is all touch screen. So as I say, if I wanted to zoom in and zoom out, you can see here and destination entry. So you press on that. And then obviously add your um, add your postcode or the address wherever it is you need to go, and then you just press search and it will um, it'll take you where you need to go. Once again, all touch screen, which is nice. Back onto the home page. Phone. Obviously there is no phone connected at the moment, so obviously no phone found because there is no phone connected onto the car. Would you like to search for a new phone? You just press yes. Your phone will currently be obviously on the screen after, um, and you are able to to connect your phone. Obviously, once the phone is connected, any phone any phone calls that come through, you can answer them um, on the um, on the screen, so you don't have to touch your um, touch your phone at all, which is ideal. So it gives you the hands-free option. And then, last but not least, let's go on to audio. So it does have the AM and FM radio. You also have your CD player, which is just down below here. Your buttons below. You also have, as you can see, the rear heated screen. The front as well is a heated screen. Um, you have obviously all your buttons just there with obviously the aircon as well. So you don't obviously have to go onto the screen, you can set everything up just here. Electric parking brake does have the two cup holders, you also have the uh, front armrest as well. Obviously, the trip computer on the dash. So it is a nice, clean car in the inside, as you can see. It is pet free and smoke free, which is quite ideal as well. So there is no funny odors inside the vehicle. Right, you've seen the condition of the exterior and interior of the car. If there is any further questions or you need to find it's arranging, then please don't hesitate to give us a call as we're more than happy to help you and answer any of your questions. All right, thanks for watching.